Hey everybody, welcome to Chance's Chat, where I'm doing, I have no idea what I'm doing. This is just going to be kind of my whole ADHD taking charge. Um, who knows? This will be kind of an experiment, and it'll probably be a little rough on the first one. Maybe as I get through it, it'll be a little bit better. Every day I'm hustling, 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 hustling. So what we are going to do today is we're going to play around with a uh, little plastic empire. Everyone uh, out there in internet land seems to really hate plastic empire, especially their mystery boxes. So I was curious. I went out, got one, and I haven't opened it. It's sitting right down here. So we're going to figure out if it's really the value or if it's what everyone says. Absolute trash. But first, I'm also going to read off some of the comments, because, wow, these comments are a little harsh. We've got, uh, from one of the Twitter accounts I follow, an um, awesome account called Diz Trackers. I highly suggest other people go to it, or don't, that's up to you. But uh, they give updates on when some of the Funkos are coming out, some of the other stuff that is highly sought after. But I did notice this one, and that's actually why I want to check this out and open this on live just to, ch just to see. But on uh, Black Friday, which I have some of the boxes here we might go through, um, there was a mystery box gift that came from Plastic Empire. And there was multiple ways you could do it. Um, I, I think I ended up doing the, the cheaper one, right? Because, um, well, I, I like Funko, but I'm not rich. Not like some of you other YouTubers out there. So um, I did that one, gosh, no more ups, but I did that one and what I decided to do was read you guys some of these comments from some of these ones. So here, Kushologist420 says, yep, I've had them and all I got was trash and I literally wanted to throw it in the trash, but just gave it away. Got another great one here. Ooh, yeah, because there was a thousand dollar ones, and this guy, uh, I love jujitsu, said thousand dollar ones. I'll see my way out. Here we go with uh, Will Kearns. Trash. Not falling for this trap again. And then everyone seems to dislike disc trackers because he's a self promoter. I don't know. Anyways. Um, some other harsh ones, some that I probably shouldn't read. Not that this is a G-rated channel, but let's not get me uh, me too right away. So let's move on to the main event, which is let's open this bad boy and see exactly what we got for our $50. And we'll be doing a, a price guide, PPG, um, to see if they do stack up to what it is. And just so you know, haven't opened it yet. Just got it yesterday. Whoop, whoop. Um, but yes, it is still sealed. I will uh, go grab my knife and uh, get this bad boy going. It's pretty light though. I would say, geez, no more than four pops in here. So let's see. Trash or kick ass. There we go. Like that one. All right. So, trusty knife here. I'm not going to look, because I kind of want to be surprised myself. And let's see if we got any grails in here. Anything that's worth something, anyways. Or anything that, hopefully, as you can see, and I can probably show you a few more back here. And we got that wall. I've got a few pops. So let's hope that some of these are not the duplicate ones that I already own. If so, who knows? Maybe I'll figure out a, a giveaway for you guys. And... Uh, Get you something really nice out there. Get myself started here. Okay. So like I said, I'm not going to look. I'm just going to kind of grab the first thing that I uh, feel. Ooh. Oh, that's interesting. Now, I'm really hoping that there might be a carnage black light. Fingers crossed. Okay, so I felt around. And I've got two. Two pops here. That's going to be pretty hard to get to that $100 value. This one does have a pot protector on it, 
So, actually, let's do it this way. This is kind of cool. Let's do it up here and let's see what we got. Ooh, reveal is what? It's Secret Base Heidi. Zero clue who this is. Zero. Point zero. Maybe too much lighting there. Got to figure out this whole thing. Not a YouTuber, but maybe I should be. But anyways, um, yeah, that's it right there. Heidi ho, Heidi he, Heidi Heidi ho. Um, let's see what this guy values at. I have no idea what this. Oh, it's Pop Asia. Okay, so this looks like a Ronald McDonald knockoff, right? Ronald McDonald. I don't know what I do. All right, let's go ahead and see what the PPG is on this bad boy or girl. Probably boy, but I don't want to be, you know, sexist. All right, so here we go. Trusty scanner. Let's see what this goes for. Oof, boy. It's still in the plastic wrap. I might have to take that out. Might not be able to get the, maybe. So it's from PopLife. PopLife.com. And guess what? It's got this uh, funky bottom piece on here that I gotta take off, so. Okay, there we go. Now, let's try that again. Let's see what Secret Base Heidi is worth. Hitty? Heidi? Mm, I don't know. Oh, oh, sorry. Looks like you can't find Heidi. So rare that it is not even in the database. How cool is that? It's so rare, not even the database. Oof. All right, well, let's let's go ahead and just write it in here. Shouldn't have to really do that, but let's go secret base Hitty. Heidi. I don't know how to say that, guys. Oh, there it is. Found it. Oh, not Heidi Blue. Oh, that one's worth a lot of money, though. Okay. Heidi Original. Sure looks like that one. Oh, all right. There you go. 60 bucks. PPG. Not bad, right? Not bad. So, so far, got my money's worth. Oh, boy. There's some other weird ones in there, right? Oof. Okay. Interesting. Someone uh, in the comments can tell me what secret base is. I Probably could go look it up, but I'm not going to, honestly. All right, second one. Here we go. Come on. Let's get like a super rare one and let's let's shut down the haters. Um, Plastic Empire, thank you for this lovely box that I paid for. So I don't really know why I'm thanking you. you thank me, but that's all right. Um, so far, gave me one that I have no idea how I'm going to use or when I'm going to use it or whatever. Maybe I'll sell it. Who knows? Okay. So, second one. Oh, it's almost like Christmas, right? Get a little opening. Oh man, it's Christmas for Christmas. And who is it? Is it Black Light Carnage? I don't think so. What the hell is that? Mm. Oh, Voltron maybe? Animation? Volts V? got some sort of interesting sticker from uh, oh look at that it's from Everett um, it is some sort of like uh, big boys edition I don't know. again I don't I don't really collect too much in the animation line I'm more of the uh, like you know, black light stuff Marvel stuff definitely Star Wars diamonds I like stickers I like stickers stickers are good they're good all right let's see what this bad boy tops out at dun 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 bolts b unfortunately lost two dollars yesterday man rough day yesterday but hey bolts b is worth 44 bucks so let's put it this way i spent 50 dollars and i ended up getting over a hundred dollars ppg that's not bad guys so, as much as a uh, few of you want to trash on Plastic Empires or these mystery boxes, ah, my first experience was good. 
But let's keep the fun going, right? I like this like kind of Christmas for Christmas, Christmas thing, right? Let's, um, I did get a bunch of um, Black Friday specials from some of the uh, you know major companies, and I kind of forgot what I got. Um, I guess that's how it goes in the Funko Pop collecting. You say, oh man, that's a deal. I know I can say that and that's worth a lot of money. Oh wait, no, oh, oh no, that's not how I do it. I just actually like what I get. Um, and my ADHD allows for me to like everything. So let's see what we got here. Now this one's from FYE, favorite. I think that's like favorite yokel entertainer, FYE maybe. I don't know. Um, but it's like a knockoff Hastings. Do you guys remember that? I'm outdating myself. Um, but this looks kind of cool. I got myself two mystery pops, even though they shouldn't be a mystery because I bought them only a month ago. And that's how crazy the shipping is, right? It's a little slow these days. So let's see what I got here. Let's see a reminder. What did I get? What? Who is that? Ch -ch -ch. Oh, yeah, hell yeah, John Lennon, the uh, 2021 limited edition one. I do have another John Lennon one back here somewhere. Oh, there he is. So now we got two Johns, woo woo, and just for fun, my son's name and my dad's name is John. So what the what? Not John Lennon, though, otherwise I probably would be here doing this, but who knows, right? All right, let's put this up right next to the Frog Boys. Yeah, I like that, Frog Boys. Let's see what else I got here. Ooh, this one's a good one, I can tell. Just by the way it feels. Dun, dun, dun. Hell yeah. Perfect timing for Christmas. Clark W. Griswold. Special edition, FY exclusive. Remember when he went down the hill? With the WD-40, but it was like some sort of special WD-40, and went poof, flying through there. You can see this burnt sled right there. This kicks butt. But that's awesome. All right, let's keep the fun going. Come on. So I'm not sure if you guys do the Entertainment Earth. Last one left. Um, probably shouldn't give away this secret in case you know y'all do it. But I'm guessing anyway. Watching this already does it, so is what it is but from time to time if you check the just one left on ee you can find some pretty good deals now i'm not a crazy it's got to be every single thing perfect i'm okay with some imperfection i just really like the different characters and lines so this one these ones i picked up from the ee just one left pretty cheap i think each one of these were like seven eight bucks a piece and this one's amazing i love this one add to my halloween collection Little uh, vampire crusty. Who doesn't love the Simpsons? This one, come on, this is my generation, man. Back when they used to play actual videos. Uh, give the MTV Moon person, Moon Man. Remember those awards, VMAs? No, no. Go back, Google it, YouTube it. And then last one, actually finishes off my second suicide squad collection harley quinn in her i don't know dress whatever thingy i don't know it's the last one i need to actually I take that back there's a con exclusive from amazon that hasn't dropped yet um what's his name merle from walking dead that guy i don't know so anyways that's it guys that's that's my crazy um black friday a couple days after black friday all savings type of deal um i think i really did get a pretty good deal on the whole thing with the plastic empire i mean i don't know i'll, I'll guess i'll display these i mean uh, this one at 64 bucks that's close to one of my top ones I've, I've got a few up in that range but um maybe a couple more so i don't know this guy's gonna have to be vaulted it's got a weird weird box though i think it's because it's so old i don't know all right guys well um hope the rest of you had good collecting this last couple of weeks and black friday i will be dropping uh, at least one of these videos a month probably i don't know quite how i'm gonna do it and like i said while we're on the funko land today 
man, we can go over lots of things that I nerd out on from action figures to I wrote a couple of books to, um, God, life, music, good things, right? So I hope you have a good rest of your holiday because I won't be back probably before New Year's, that's for sure. Don't drink too much. Stay off the roads. Have a good one. Till next time, chance out.